A Madison woman is still shaking her head after the final minutes of last weekend's Packers game sent emergency responders to her door. A text to her niece calls a 911 call and a false alarm. In an interview you'll only see on 27 News, Rachel Perry caught up with the pair. She has you covered on how the nail-biting game left one in tears and the other with some explaining to do. Medical incident, major report. I'm having a heart attack. With just minutes left in the game, Bonnie Jones, like so many Packer fans, could feel her heart beating out of her chest. I'm pacing back and forth on my TV. She sends this exact text to her niece, Genesis Stone. It reads, I'm having a heart attack, followed by two exclamation points. My phone's ringing and it's, and it's her. And I'm like, what the heck is she calling me for? She knows I'm not going to answer, so I dismissed it. It was a Saturday, so my brain is going, it's not even a football day. There's no reason she shouldn't be picking up. Fearing the worst and over 300 miles away in Missouri, Genesis takes matters into her own hands. Dean Carney Communications. Hi, yes, I'm in Missouri, but my aunt just texted me that she was she's having a heart attack. Madison EMTs, who were also watching the game, quickly rushed over to Bonnie's, thinking she might be unresponsive and need CPR. They soon learned that wasn't the case at all. Oh my God, Jesus Christ. Okay, she's okay. Oh my God. Okay, she's okay. I can see red flashing lights all over the place. And I opened up the front door and I'm like, oh my God, you guys, I am so sorry. Today we made patient contact. Everything's all right. Just got a little excited about the game. Four of the paramedics started laughing their butts off. By the time the whole ordeal was over, the Packers had lost to the 49ers 21-24. And while it wasn't a heart attack, Genesis and Bonnie tell me the game did take a toll. Everyone had a broken heart afterwards. <laughs> In Madison, Rachel Perry, 27 News. Both Genesis and Bonnie say they want to apologize to the EMTs and thank them for their speedy response.